timing that perfectly while jumping. See, like, it's different mechanics, and at the end of the day, I, I think it's a little unfair to say that this is overly consoleized. Yeah, I agree with that. I, I think what they've really done is designed, Dude, it's you know, completely over consoleized. Well, that's not that's not a fair way of putting it. I think they've designed new sort of column pro mechanics that can be pulled off with the limitations of console controllers. But there's still things you have to master. There's still, you know, yeah, difficult to do. It's just they're easy with like, control. I understand the point. Really I am a huge Doom, Doom fan. I would love to defend anything. They I do came into this wanting to the very fucking end, fan but fan. here's the thing. <laughs> Rocket jumping is a standard of the game. It's That's a standard of Quake. Is. Yeah, it's Quake, it's not... Team Deathmatch. Yeah, I agree with you, Carlton, though. Five, four, three. What two, was that? I said I agree with you with what you said earlier. Yeah, I mean, look, it's it's mechanics that can be pulled off with the limitations of a controller but they still require skill. And I think it's amazing that they've pulled that off. I agree. And, I mean, I you know, you want to talk about biases, I've been hating on this game non-stop since I first saw the gameplay trailer. I've been, I, like, I'm a big Doom fan, but I, on this one I'm always hesitant because the usually games are influenced activated. by other games at the time. And, I mean, the development history of this was just horrible. The trouble... Yeah, like, it's been in the you know. I am glad it's kinda hard to cover because Doom was the first other than my so friend. Yeah. Activated. So pretty and much I'll, everything I'll, else copied Doom. I always laugh when people say, well, uh, Doom copied Unreal. I'm like, what? No. How's that even possible? I mean, yep. yeah, you could say it copied that old, like, Vector tank game from the arcade. What was it called? Battlezone or something? Yeah. That sounds familiar. Yeah, I think so. I haven't heard that name in eons. Yeah, that was like the first proper FBI. Gained the lead. But like, I don't. Can you copy a genre? Like, can you copy that? I mean, if point? if you were to really just think about it, then that would say that everyone copied Doom for being, you know, Incoming first person Doom shooter. Rooms. But you can't really say that because. You know, it's just a type. It's not something that necessarily can be copied. It's not like specific characters or settings. It's just mechanics. Yeah. Every every company is creating something to make their game unique. Except it feels for like Activision. this Doom just throws everything about the uniqueness of all of those games into one and makes this one awesome sort of yeah. death. I, I was just worried that, you know, they would try to play it safe to make money. That's they what they're saying. They they well, I'm pretty sure they're going to be there too, activated. but... Because, like, a lot of Yo, games... Yo, the dude's corpse was floating in the air for, like, five seconds. I love that. I had a guy running around in a T-pose, so that was definitely a... Ah, uh, the T-stance. That's the best part, because it happens in every time. Yeah. I'm surprised I haven't fallen through the map. That happens to me in every fucking game. Even, like, brand new releases, patched and all. That still happens, happens to me in Counter-Strike. I have but not like, experienced I'll fall halfway through, and I'll feel like a midget. <laughs> like my height. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, okay, now I know. Usually it happens to me um, where I'm taller, and I have to jump oh, yeah. to fix it. Or you spawn yeah, in it always happens. Yeah, but I meant like actually falling through the geometry. I have that happen to me uh, every friggin' game. It's almost like recently a I subjected myself to Duke Nukem Forever. Uh, yeah, feel free to point and laugh. And there was this one no, boss, I right? It. 
it. I hated it. I it, it was it. I caused me pain. But there's if this one boss. If you take it with what it is, I mean, it's, yeah. But I grew up on Duke, and it just doesn't feel right. Like it's hard to put into words. Something about it just doesn't jive with me. Yeah, uh, it's probably because it's, we're it's older feeling. now, but that yeah, humor I mean, I don't was know. funny like, at the time. Here's the thing, right? Duke Nukem 3D was sort of like wry and tongue in cheek and aware of what it was. Like Duke Nukem is not someone you're supposed to look up to, but like. You know, in, in Duke Nukem Forever, they, they, there's this weird combination of, like, they make him a character you're supposed to, like, idolize, but have him be, like, a horrible sadist. And I, I, don't, I don't like that. I thought that's just Incoming what he was. <laughs> it, it, like I said, it's so hard to put into words because it's a very subtle, tonal thing, you know? But it's, like, the one level with, like, the highs... Yeah. yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Like, I, I can watch, like, the girl with the dragon tattoo and not get overly, like, grossed out or weirded out because I have no soul. But, like, that hive level was just... You don't feel good your when finger you in the... It just felt a little wrong. Right, right, right. Not like, oh, like I'm sticking my finger in the alien anus. Oh, and like when when there's like the women like begging you to kill them and stuff. Like, yeah, I guess they're doing the alien uncomfortable, thing, but it. it I, yeah, and, and then it's do cracking jokes while there's that darkness going on. Like, I think that's the big thing. Like, you've got this horrible scenario, and Duke is still doing one-liners. That would have been a good time to kind of like pull back the curtain and play it really straight. And just turn it True. into this horrible subversion. But you could tell that it was just a mishmash of things they have done and finished, and you know, because that thing it was, was an idea. So many game. Yeah, made by Idea guys. We all know an Ideas guy, right? They they never do shit. But they got plenty of ideas. Yeah, that's that's me. <laughs> No, I think that's our pack or whatever his name is. Add rocket jumping. That's a quake thing. I know. He's, <laughs> he's so fixated on that though. And like the multiplayer of Doom 3 was tacked on at the last minute. It wasn't. Yeah. Good. He, he laughed at me when I said that the uh, multiplayer in Doom 3 was atrocious. He just laughed. Yeah. He said, "No, it wasn't." It had a lot of people who played it because Doom 3 sold well, but in comparison, even the Quake 4, it just wasn't that great. Yeah, and. And Quake 4 was disappointing. Like, come on. I enjoyed the campaign. I didn't play multiplayer much. I played, okay. When I was like 12, my parents wouldn't let me use the computer, but I would sneak on to play like Quake 4 online. And I played so much of it that way. And Wait, how old are you? Uh, oh, I'm like 22 now. You sound older than that. <laughs> yeah, I guess that a lot. Like which, which, what's weird is like I sound jeez, jeez. a bit older, but I look a bit younger, so people think That's I'm some important. kind of freak. The fountain of youth. And, and I'm 29, right, so I got to, I got to experience all that good shit, you know. And when internet was around, everyone on there was friendly and helpful. And every game you played yeah, had a great community. Now it's and now everyone's the, assholes. Yeah. Counter-Strike especially. Oh, oh man, I, it, it's yeah. so bad because like I meet really nice people in Counter-Strike every like one in five games. Everything else is just full of people who are like, yeah man, we're gonna fucking break the fucking team, yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. Is that unnecessary? That's how those popular war games be. But see, it doesn't have to be that way. Cause, and it wasn't when I played like, um, 1.6. That's true. Demon rune spawn. Like it's 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 a fun game. It's like online paintball more or less. Just chill. When people get that competitive, they turn into assholes. Yeah, yeah. And I think uh, you know we all get salty. Like let's get real. We all get oh, a little yeah, salty every now and then. That's one thing, you know. But when you let it consume you and you start just spouting off hate, that's another thing. Possession Score limit. All right. GG no re. Except I'm gonna be here for a while, so there will be a re. 
Yay, first place, finally. Hey, congratulations! Nice. It only took you what? <laughs> <laughs> Ever since that dev joined, I couldn't get first place, but like every game before... Well, he's a he, knows, he knows all our moves. I've studied all your moves, Sonya. I bet he can <laughs> rocket jump. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest... <laughs> Surprise! He's playing it because I'm pretty sure they play the fuck out of this testing it. Surprise, they don't like they tested it a lot. Like it doesn't feel slapdash. Yeah. It feels very fluent. Yeah, Did I'm pretty sure. Very well yeah, made. Yeah, I played the alpha. I'm pretty I, sure it, that they've they're pretty close to going gold. I'm sure the the beta we're playing now is several months behind what they have already. I don't know that they would do that. I, I think. Basically, this is their final, like, massive testing wave. They're going to get our feedback, and when they implement it, you know, that'll be the final thing. And they'll keep updating it if they're smart over the life well, of the product. Well, they'll keep updating it. The thing is, is I've had friends in other development studios that have, when there's a month till release, they're actually, like, kind of patching everything up, and that's that. There's no changes. They're, um... What is it called? Uh, design lock or something like that. New features are added. Feature lock. Lock, thank you. How do we feel about the music in this one? I like it. Oh, I enjoy it. Oh, I think it feels great. It, it feels needs like more, kinda... more metal. Like, I, I've always yeah. wanted that. See, I like the kind of vague industrial sort of thing going on. It's very... Modern, but also very 90s, like 90s. Oh, yeah, but... Team Deathmatch. Um, I was referring to... Um, Doom 3, because they didn't have any really music. They had that theme that sounded like a Tool song. I like that. Five, but like... Four, that three, was composed by two, the Nine Inch Nails guy. Because he was originally on as a sound designer for Doom 3. Okay, I, I hate to be a pedantic dick, but it wasn't composed by Trent Reznor, it was composed by the drummer, the live drummer for Nine Inch Nails. Oh, and I know this because I'm an obsessive fan of Nine Inch Nails. Trent Reznor was going to do sound design for Doom 3. Because he did have sounds already done for Doom 3. And they're better than what they ended up with. Yeah. They're kind of muffled with uh, what the final release was, or muffled and just didn't sound. Uh, that shotgun sounded fucking terrible. Yeah. I don't, I'm it glad sounded I got like to play the Alpha. Time, right? AMD leaked that alpha back then, and I was like, holy shit, and I got to play it. Super. <laughs> did Super you ever play the Half-Life 2 leak? Yeah, I did. Dude, th that oh, was man. around the same time, too. Like, yeah. it was that, and it was a fantastic couple of years for leaks. Um, Stalker, I don't know if you guys know what that game yep. is, but, yep. That Get leaked out. Get out Stalker. And... My friend and I kind of debated that it could have been on purpose because it had updates to the leak. Wow. Like, frequently. Oh, shit. See, I don't know how to feel about leaks because it's cool to see, like, it's kind of cool to see more about something, but, like, at the same time, you're not going to be going in blind anymore. Yeah, well, it also hurts the development for, for oh, people oh, who are not in the knowing. Because uh, people like us understand it's a leak, things change, obviously. But most people don't. They treat it as a demo, and they rate it on that. Deus Ex uh, Human Revolution got hit pretty bad by that. Yeah. Which is a shame, because that game was fucking amazing, minus the boss battles. I agree. Oh man, Mankind Divided is coming out soon. I'm excited. I'm glad that they delayed it, which, like, that sounds weird to say, but, like, they, they got the extra time, they're gonna polish it up even more. I am so hyped.
This feels really good after playing it for like an hour or two hours. It's really, really yeah. Fun yeah, it feels fun. It feels good. Uh, it lets a fine. good player be good, you know? Like, it, yeah. I don't feel like I'm being shafted by game mechanics. What are you talking about? There's no rocket jump. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh man, that's the new meme. That's the... Yes. It has to be. And that guy, our attack or whatever, started it. On Reddit, though, people are pretty disappointed about the graphics options, but again, Ada, they're not going to they're not gonna have that sort of um, I am yeah. the point. So uh, I the, wanted to be able to customize that. One of the id developers was on here, and I asked him about that, and he said it's activated. locked right now, the advanced tab, but he really didn't divulge what was in there. Well, there was FOB sliders and stuff like that. The yeah, They've already got, good. like, temporal anti-aliasing, which is a crazy new feature, so I'm wondering what other graphics tests they're going to reveal in that menu. Yeah, and it's not, I mean, shit. Config alterations and stuff, I and mean, that's what uh, its engines are designed for. So I'm sure someone will do something to it. Vital sign. Yeah, I was reading you could already unlock the 6B FPS lock on it. Just have to like go into. The I you know, like I prefer smooth 60 than Same rapidly thing. fluctuating above 60. Like yeah, it'd be nice. nice. Oh, I prefer 120, but 60. Oh no, if you could get solid 120 or 144, like you'd be set. But like. Solid 60 just, it's, it's okay. It's, you know, yeah, it's not good. Like, I don't feel handicapped. Vital signs. Are the console versions running at 60? Does anyone know? Ooh, that, that's a good question, honestly. I assume I so, because that, if you think back to it when Rage came out, that's one thing that kind of dumbed it down was when it kind of goes to 60 frames on the console. I feel like if they could at least get the multiplayer at 60, that would be fine. Like, single player 30 is not a big deal. Yeah. Because you don't need as much, you know, reaction time. Yeah, when it comes to multiplayer, more frames the better. But single player... So one thing I've noticed, you have, you have like, infinite grenades, and they're just on a timer. Yeah, it just... That's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's yeah, beautiful. I it's like, you have to be skilled to use the grenades right, but you're not going to get penalized too bad for trying to learn, you know? Yeah, I usually use the grenades just to run away. I throw it down, then run away and try to find health. Maybe they'll add, like, a smokescreen grenade at some point. To just, like, you get the full magician exit, just drop a yeah. smoke pellet in the <laughs> I'll tell you what, I really like this uh, rocket launcher and double shotgun uh, combo. I gotta be honest, I'm not super... I don't really like the new rocket launcher as much. It doesn't feel as hefty. But maybe that's just because I'm not good with that. Well, honestly, if you use it and hit someone direct on and get a 55 uh, damage on them, use your shotgun right after and you'll kill them. Yeah, I mean, that's the combo I'm favoring, but I find I'm pretty much using shotgun exclusively. I like the lightning gun and the plasma. It's pretty fun. The lightning gun's pretty good. I I haven't tried the plasma enough to get comfortable with it. How do we feel about midair rocket detonation? I like it. Tactic strategy. Oh, earlier I was trying to kill a sniper guy. Rocket there. jump. <laughs> <laughs> I I shouldn't shit on the guy too much, but it's not necessarily a terrible idea. Yeah, yeah. no, we're just. Having when you first came in here, did you hear me? We're having a goofy gaff and a laugh. It's, it's all good. Oh no, he laughed. Aww. He had enough. Oh, he's gonna kill me. 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 I feel bad about that. Like, legitimately. I wanted him in here more. No, he, dude, when he came in, I mean, did you hear him? He was really toxic. He, oh god, no. Absolutely, but I kind of feed on that. Oh yeah, only well, too, but I mean like he was very, very salty about this. That's why I had a little fun with him. I think Even we all in did. front of him to hit him in the development. Like holy shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. Show some fucking tact.
Well, he calmed down after, I don't know, was it the stalker? Or when the id employee him. called him toxic, he was like, eh, I'm gonna calm down a bit. Yeah, the dev was just having a little fun. He was pretty funny. Yeah, I enjoyed him. I've seen him around. Like, yeah, I've added him. This, that, this is just like the craziest thing. I played a game with one of its developers. Like, I shouldn't be so freaky about that, but like, it's a good feeling they give it to Oh, dude, I've played a lot of beta, so you kind of get used to that and uh, you lose the um, celebrity, what do they call it? Uh, it's not celebrity, it's more like I feel like this game is in good hands, and I'm excited about that. Yeah. I um, Score limit got to play with some yeah, uh, Gearbox developers when Brothers in Arms Hell's Highway came out. I've always wanted to get into that series. Oh, second place! Hi! Guys, Rocket Jump Man left. I think the fun is gone. There's no hope. All is lost. Do you know if there's a level cap for the for this beta? Maybe? Fifteen. Yeah, fifteen. Oh, I'm right about there. I don't think I've unlocked any more uh, armor pieces since yeah, I hit that cap. Yeah, you at fifteen. I kind of like that there's randomness to it. Yeah, but I want more shit. Damn it. Oh yeah, same. I don't. I was messing around. Apparently, it's tied to your save game on your uh, document.